What's up guys, Christmas Eve here and fodder is making it rain in the clan chat. 100 gems for everybody all around. Love having the favor return, man. Super cool. Thanks so much and Merry Christmas to you and yours as well. Hey, what's going on everybody? It is Power Bang bringing you guys another video. It is Christmas Eve. I've got my hair cut. The ears have been lowered. You know, we're going to be seeing Grandma today, so, you know, we can't be disappointing her with that hobo look we've had been going on the last couple of weeks. So, I know you guys have made some comments about it. I took care of it. Still got to clean this up, but uh, other than that, we're looking fresh and clean, man. So, let's get right into it, guys. I don't know if you all know who the A-Team 2 is, but... Uh, let's check out the war details. To go to the enemy team, you can see that they are part of the elite nation that is the Clash with Ash family. Uh, they do say good luck to WHF2, so good luck to you guys as well. Hopefully uh, you get everything out of this war that you want and more. That being said, uh, Clash with Ash and I have teamed up to bring you guys a Christmas $500 giveaway. Uh, you can definitely check out how to enter. There's about 40 hours left in that contest. Check the link in the description, guys. $500 being given away. Uh, you could claim your share of that by just going to the link in the description, subscribing to both of us on YouTube, as well as following on Twitter. That's all that you have to do, and uh, you can win. So that being said, let's hop into some attacks, guys. Uh, unfortunately, could not wait for the war to end because I, like everybody else, I've got Christmas stuff to go do today, so I'm not going to be in the office uh, recording stuff. So let's jump into some attacks here. I'll try to cover as much of the war that's gone down as possible right now. WHF2 has jumped out to a very large lead, and we are looking to maintain that moving forward. So we've got a really heavy, uh, maxed out Town Hall 11 base here. May not have some of the, uh, the new wizard towers, but other than that, uh, it's looking pretty fierce. So Hilda's going to be attacking this one. Where is she coming from? Ah, there we go. we got some archers kind of picking off some buildings from around the side. And uh, we will go ahead, fast forward it, and wait for those archers to kind of pick things off. So uh, all around the base, getting that easy percentage. Free buildings. There we go. From the left, queen charge coming in. And uh, that queen goes through the wall, taking on that king right away inside of a rage belt. No health really lost. Awesome job on that king kill. Going to get the uh, storage taken down. When somebody comes into this ring style of base, you're always one of the key on those air defenses, just like that. One of the very first defenses that was taken down. Great job to Hilda on that. And that's going to allow her to freely walk kind of the edge of this base without worrying about getting her healer shot down. Other side, the other corner, you're going to see this a lot. Breaking the funnel here. Going to enter in at the corner with the king, with the bowlers. There's the wall breaker coming down. Opens up the wall. Eagle artillery is active, so he's got to watch out for that. Bowlers take a little bit of a hit here, but notice how they're destroying these buildings, and they're going to kind of walk off to the right. Now, the queen, she has gone down to the south, but that leaves up, look at this little trail of buildings all the way to the core. Uh, quad quake has come down. Wall segment open. Look at the Valkyries taking out these buildings and going straight into the core. Rage Spell takes out the eagle and the infernos instantly. Easily takes down the town hall. Absolutely loving it. The Valkyries crushing through this base, taking out the junction here, taking out the Inferno Tower, and moving on to all of this, you know, Wizard Tower Expo action, but already has the two-star in the bag. Level 42 Queen on defense. Interesting stuff there. 27 seconds left in this raid. We'll go ahead and fast forward the rest of it because it's basically just that queen uh, putting out pressure, trying to pick up as much percentage as possible, but she is going to go down. Those level 20 Grand Wardens actually hit really hard on defense, but an awesome two-star there. Wonderful use of wall breakers as well as funneling to get that uh, Valkyrie squad to the core, so awesome job on that. Scrolling down a little bit more, we got Dave hitting, getting hit by Aussie G here. Aussie G, first time on the channel, man. Congrats, and uh, let's go ahead and watch as the baby... Pay attention to this baby dragon, guys. Watch the value uh, that it gets on the entry here. It's flirting with death with that air defense right in range, sitting just outside of range. Uh, but it's really, really awesome. It's just going to go in and get so much value there, getting that funnel created, taking out an air targeting defense, and uh, really like to see that stuff. So jump spell going in. Goal here is to take out the Inferno, the Air Defense, the King and Queen, as well as the Clan Castle coming out. Drag Loon coming out of the Clan Castle, that's always a blessing. When you see a Drag Loon come out of the Clan Castle, it's very easy to manage. Poison spells will completely neutralize it, and uh, it's much better than the Hound coming out and slowing up your uh, you know, your kill squad, taking your Queen out of play. So there's the ability. Queen gets one of the Air Defense on the bottom here. King takes out the Air Defense up top, so that's two Air Defenses down. Watch the timing here on the Balloon 
balloons as well as the hound. Uh, check out the timing uh, of the loon drops here as these balloons come in. Notice the wizard tower firing early. That would have been a death sentence before, but now, boom, instantly they come in, take it out. Expo's going to be going down as well. Queen's going to help out with that. The balloons are heading into that air defense. Wonderful pathing there by Ozzy. Absolutely loved it. Free spell on point. Unfortunately, he misses the bomb tower over here. He's going to have to come back for it. That's okay. But we've got two hounds sitting on the final air defense. Air targeting defense up top taken out by the balloons and everything pathing now all the way to the last section. Wizard Tower, the only threat left in the base. Queen and Grand Warden come over to hang out. Has a swag heal as well as four balloons that have yet to be used. He's going to take out that final cannon and look at that. Clean up crew on the balloons. Wonderful attack from Ozzy. Getting that three star for the good guys dipping down on the nuke. Much easier now on the nukes uh, than they were in uh, uh, months past. Let's go ahead and take out uh, credit here. This is an awesome attack. Uh, six healers, 13 baby dragons, and check out the work with this baby dragon as well. Uh, down south, we're going to watch this guy in action, taking out a few defenses, and again, flirting with death with this baby dragon, uh, over, you know, kind of coming around the, uh, what is that, an air defense? Yes, that's what we're talking about. So there's the baby dragons getting some absolute work done. Wonderful job, and uh, the queen, now that he's used three baby dragons to take out a lot of outside buildings and trash, uh, to help with the funneling process that Queen's going to walk. Once this cannon's taken out, she's got nowhere to go but reverting back to this Tesla here, to the Wizard Tower here, and getting into the base. So check this out. Takes out the cannon. Queen's going to start walking in, and what do you know, right to a Tesla farm. What do you think about this uh, channel here, guys? That Queen's going to walk in. Look at the access to this entire base. This thing is wrecked if the Queen can stay alive. So he actually has four healers on her right now inside of a rage spell. It's going to take a... Uh, uh, a shot at the air defense, gets it taken out, and now that the air defense is taken out, here comes the remaining healers just to make sure that she's going to stay alive and backed up throughout this uh, push into the base. Uses the ability on the Valkyrie and Baby Dragon CC and does manage to stay alive. Look at all that funneling done on the left side here, and that's going to allow uh, quick, quick targeting of the Queen rather than getting hung up on all of those storages here. So King comes down on the bottom right while the Archer Tower is distracted by the Queen, and then we've got Bowlers doing their thing behind the King, kind of making sure that everything's cleared out. Wonderful job on that. They're going to try to take out this Mortar get around the corner. Ultimately, this air defense is the goal with that kill squad there, and if they don't take it out, at least they can, uh, you know, weaken it up or take out the trash, uh, so to speak, in between uh, the outer ring of this base and the air defense, so it can become directly targetable. So the queen continues to push through the core. Rage spell down. Poison for the enemy king. Uh, here comes the queen engagement. That rage spell is going to keep her up just long enough to do enough damage to the queen. Get her taken out. Here we go around the outside of the ring, guys. Bowler's getting that air defense weak, but not quite finishing it off. Archer Tower does go down, though. Bowler finishing it off, and the Queen still rocking in the core, guys. One more Rage Spell still in the bag for the Queen. You're going to see that come down here in just a minute as the cannons, the expo, everything locked on. And wouldn't you know it, everything is focused on the Queen right now, and the Baby Dragons are easily able to kind of, you know, dip in, take everything out, and look at the army camps, guys. A Rage Spell left, five Baby Dragons left, three minions left. None of it needs to be dropped. I think he drops a Baby Dragon here for fun of it. We'll fast forward through the the rest but I mean what in the world dude credit absolutely smashing this base love the attack buddy taking down that base in style next up we've got woolly pancake getting taken out by Peter here here we've got the laloon in action here after the update and guys just pay attention to the speed of the loon drops coming in here to the buildings. Uh, he gets some great tanking in. Uh, I believe he comes in from the upper right with the kill squad. The goal here is to walk that golem down the wall, take fire from all of the defense in the base. Now, as he's parked where he's at, check this out. Barely in range of the cannon, barely in range of all of this stuff. Uh, beautifully placed uh, golem there. So now the wizard's able to create a massive funnel. And as that golem is exploding... Finally, the wizards are able to be targeted on the right side, but you can see the jump spell going to come down. King going in, that queen kind of doing a little bit of a walk behind the golems here, eventually going to go to the jump spell. The goal here is to take out this air defense. Now, once that air defense is taken out, she will wander over to the other side, to the clan castle, to the expo. Ultimately, this other air defense is the secondary goal once that clan castle is taken out. So, awesome job with the entry there. Two air defenses going to get taken out as well as the clan castle kill and the archer queen. Uh, so, really nice work from Peter here. Now, two air defenses left and he's got hounds and loons for it. Watch the placement here of the hounds and loons as that queen is kind of pushing through the town hall. 
going for that third air defense. Here comes the balloons. Really, really early start on those balloons because it is ground targeting stuff. Now look at this. Look at the hound get in front right as the uh, you know the air defense is going to come into play. And what do you know? A haste spell is going to go down. Seeking air mine misses the hound, but unfortunately targets the balloon, and it does look like now that Tesla farm could become an issue. Now this is where I want you guys to pay attention to the speed of the balloons. Watch the rage spell here. Just three or four balloons, no, three balloons left, and inside of a Tesla farm, look at that, able to take out two of those key buildings, and then the last balloon gets there, takes it out, unbelievable job with the balloons, and then targeting the backside here. Great work from Peter. I really like this raid because it highlighted some of the new mechanics. Uh, that raid, I think, before would have been dead in the water with that Tesla farm there, taking out all of those balloons before they could get off a bomb drive. So awesome work to him. Where are we at next? Let's go down to number 21. Let's check out AV here. AVI is going to be taking on uh, SSS with some arrows. Yeah, dog. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I just don't know. Anyway, uh, we've got a Laloon attack here again, and it looks like a little Queen Charge action as well. Exposed air defense here, that's going to be a target. Um, got some wall breakers in the camp. Possibly this is going to be a target as well. We'll see. Giant comes down for some tanking. It looks like he's discovered a Tesla farm as well, so that's going to be a very big key as far as Oh, where am I going to send my uh, Lava Hounds later on in this raid when we go after this air defense? We can actually swing it over the Tesla farm and then approach with the balloons to take that out very nicely. So, fast forwarding through some of the charge, you're going to see here, uh, as soon as that Archer Tower is distracted by the Queen, in come the Wall Breakers. Uh, the King also protects them as well. Wall Breakers are going to open up a direct path to this air defense. That is the key building there. Now the King's going to be going around. We still have a Clan Castle full of something. Let's see what that is. Here's the Poison spell. Misses this uh, poison a little bit. Unfortunately, the minions are going to step outside of that poison, but the wizard taking them out for the most part. Baby Dragon doing absolute work. Uh, but one healer goes down to the Seeking Air Mine. Queen finishing up on that CC. Uh, once that is taken care of, she will step in, take out the bomb tower, get busy on the Expos. Here is where you're going to see... Uh, her start to head towards the enemy queen. We do have a Valkyrie in the camp. It's going to be interesting to see how that's used. Here comes the balloons. They start the balloons first and then fly the hound exactly like we talked about right over that Tesla farm. Beautifully done. Second hound doing the same thing. Watch the balloons up there, guys. Look at this. Boom, 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 boom. All Tesla's gone. Just super fast balloon drops and the haste spell is just kind of speeding everything along even more. And as they get to the next building, just taking everything completely out. Lovely Lava Hound deployment up top there. Grabs the uh, Archer Tower here and then the Air Defense as well. And also takes all of the bombs out around that Air Defense. Check this out. Queen on Queen action uh, is able to take that Queen out. And uh, beautifully done there. Balloons kind of coming from this uh, top side. The queen finally has gone down, uh, but it does look as though from the backside, we've got all those last couple of balloons taking out the archer tower. They will arrive just in time. There it is. Boom. The bomb has been dropped. The archer tower will go down at this point. And then we've got cleanup crew inbound. Two swag rages. Absolutely love the attack uh, from Avi here. Absolutely loving the war right now from WHF2. They are kicking butt. So props to them, 59 to 15 is the current score, looking at the three star count, 15 to two. Great work to my brethren here in WHF2, and I love the generosity in the chat, man. Dropping those uh, those gems for everybody. Thank you again to Fodder. Hopefully you all have a Merry Christmas and a Happy Holiday. Don't forget to check the link in the description for the gems. This is Power Bang, though. I'm out, gotta get some sleep before I go see Grandma and open some presents. Take care, guys, have a good one.